In a recent chat about the upcoming Spider-Man projects, director Mark Webb was asked about the possibility of seeing fan favorite J. Jonah Jameson in the films. Webb responded with the following. I like the idea very much of him coming up in the next film. It was more easy to accept a new Spider-Man than someone who could outdo J.K. Simmons in that role. He is so iconic. That's something we really talked about. Obviously, I love that character because he poses such an interesting dilemma for Spider-Man. The answer is, I don't know, but I think you can expect to see him in the future. Schnapp, do you think it would be a good idea to bring Jameson into the movies? Uh, definitely. I mean, if he's not in um, The Amazing Spider-Man 2, that's okay. They have like 60 villains. So I'm like, <laughs> hang on. Let J. Jonah Jameson have his spotlight in The Amazing Spider-Man 3. Um, I think, you know, like I saw, at WonderCon, I saw somebody cosplaying as uh, J. Jonah Jameson. Yeah, I saw that guy too. And yeah, what yeah. popped into my mind was J.K. Simmons. Oh, yeah. See what I'm saying? Like, it's like, you see that picture of Mark Webb with an animated J. Jonah Jameson. That's what he looks like in the animated world. But who do you see? When in the live action world, I see J.K. Simmons. <laughs> Parker! Hey! You know, just like, come on. He destroyed that role. He owned it. He owns that character. So for someone to take over, they have to, they have to wipe away that J. Jonah Jameson of J.K. Simmons version. Uh, they're going to have to inhabit, get a new actor who inhabits it with that same kind of manic energy that J. Jonah as a character has. So w waiting till the third film is totally fine with me. If he shows up at the end, maybe it's a, that's a spoiler. I don't know if he shows up. Um, that would be awesome, too. But if they have to wait for him to get his job, you know, with the, the bugle, the Daily Bugle, until the third film, that's cool. I mean, as long as they eventually introduce him, I think he's an, uh, an integral part of the Spider-Man mythos. So. One of the things that makes J. Jonah Jameson such a really cool character and really rich and ripe for the big screen is the fact that not only is he so loud and large, but he's fascinating because he is an absolute jerk who is also at his core a good guy. Mm -hmm. An absolute jerk who at his core is a good guy. There have been some really great uh, comic stories that have gone where, where Jameson has actually stood up for some really important issues and causes and things like that because of his moral center, but he's still a dick mm -hmm. sometimes. And I right. love that, right. I think that's right. fascinating. Right. But you're right, I can't look at any picture, drawing, animated, whatever, of J. Jonah Jameson without thinking of J.K. Simmons. And I can't watch those damn farmers commercials that J.K. <laughs> Simmons is in and not see J. Jonah Jameson. It's one same. Look, I've said this before, I will say it again. I believe when you reboot something, you wipe everything that is old about it away. You don't bring back the same director, you don't bring back any of the same actors, you start fresh, it's a reboot. But I will make an exception. For mm -hmm. J.K. Simmons is J. Jonah mm -hmm. Jameson. If you're going to have one exception, you bring him back. And I'm telling you, I don't think any Spider-Man fan anywhere would be upset by the notion of J.K. Simmons coming back to play Jonah Jameson again. I would differ. I would. I think he he was in the three Spider-Man films that Raimi did. I'd like to see a different actor do their spin on J. J. Jonah Jameson. But you wouldn't be angry if you heard that J.K. was. Coming I wouldn't back be angry, right? but I would like. I mean, I think J.K. You know, he did such an amazing job. He's imprinted on those three films. It's true. I'd say let someone else try to unimprint it or make their own mark as J. Jonah. Hey everyone, if you like this video, click that thumbs up button and make sure to subscribe to our AMC Movie News YouTube channel. It's free and helps you stay up to date with all the latest movie news as well as our daily AMC Movie Talk Show. Also, make sure that you follow us on Facebook and Twitter to stay up to date with all of our special promotions, contests, and prize giveaways.